Did you know that ChatGPT is not the only AI there is? Well, of course you knew. No matter how good ChatGPT is, it's not perfect. ChatGPT is a jack of all trades, a master of none. It can do so many things, but it isn't a professional in any of them. That's why more task-focused AIs are popping like mushrooms after the rain, and that's what we're gonna explore now. Let's look at five more alternatives to ChatGPT for more specific tasks that will help you do more in less time. I will start with fellow programmers. Coding has never been easy and developers usually have to operate at the full capacity to finish the task at hand. All that coding, debugging, optimization, so time consuming. But who said it should always be like this? GitHub Copilot X is here to change the rules of the game. It's like having a coding buddy who is a total genius and helps you write code like a pro. Copilot X learns from millions of developers and uses that knowledge to give you suggestions in real time. It's like having access to an entire community of experienced coders right at your fingertips. No more endless searching through documentation or forums for code examples. Copilot X knows what you need and provides suggestions tailored to your project. It can even generate complete code snippets for you. Say you need to create a function. Just describe what you want it to do and Copilot X will generate the code. Of course, you'll want to review and refine the code, but it gives you an amazing head start and saves you loads of time. The best part about Copilot X is that it's super user-friendly. It seamlessly integrates into popular code editors, so it feels like a natural extension of your workflow. As you start typing, Copilot X jumps in with suggestions and completes lines of code based on the context. It can help you educate yourself, explain stuff to you, and so on. You can ask it to debug the code, help generate tests and stuff. All the stuff that you programmers really hate can now be done in seconds without wasting your nerves. Copilot X X isn't here to replace you as a developer, it's here to enhance your skills and make coding more enjoyable. Whether you are a seasoned pro or just starting out, Copilot X will be your trusty sidekick, always ready to help you out. So if you are a programmer and want to make your job slightly easier, try Copilot X out. The second AI is called Pi, and I will tell you right off the bat, it's more for having fun, at least for me. Pi is like your own personal chatbot that uses artificial intelligence to have conversations with you. It's designed to be smart, intuitive, and super helpful. Whether you need assistance with a task or simply want to have a friendly chat, Pi is there to keep you company. That's what the developers want you to think, and I can confirm that it's not far from the truth. The main difference that I notice between Pi and, let's say, ChatGPT is how natural Pi is. When you chat with it, you don't get a feeling that you are commanding a computer program. It's more like talking to a real person. You will have your own witty conversations, your own jokes, and so on. And while Pi can do things for you, it will always respond in a very human way, which will make the times when it's wrong even funnier. I, for example, asked it to compose a song about AI. It's friendly and helpful and always there to provide advice. It's not scary or dangerous. It's just a computer. and it basically wrote only one couplet. And when I pointed out that it looked more like a haku, it just agreed and admitted that it isn't its best attempt. And that's what I like about it. Pi is fun and somewhat unpredictable, and that's exactly what makes it interesting. So if you're tired of all those obedient AI chatbots, give Pi a try. The next AI tool is Elicit. Elicit is by far the best tool any researcher or student may need. No matter what scientific work you're creating, finding appropriate materials is always a struggle. Having to manually look for articles and publications, read them all, find important pieces, and then embed them in your own work, that's what prevents humans from starting a colony on Mars. God damn it! <laughs> With Elicit, you can automate all that boring research work. Here is how it works. You just open a website and input a question. Let's say how coffee affects emotional state of teenagers. After a few seconds, we get all the information we need. On the left, we can see the summary, which combines answers from different research papers. On the right, we can see the list of publications that covers this topic in a way and a short abstract regarding the question you ask. At the same time, you can see the paper title, its authors, publication year, the magazine of publication, the number of citations, and so on. You can even open the paper as a PDF file for deeper examples 
examination. If you click on any of the results, you'll get the full text of the paper on the right and full paper summary on the left. From there, you can know what the study was about, how it was conducted and so on. You can even ask questions about the particular article, which will be highlighted in the text for your easier citation. Believe me, this tool is a big deal. I know quite a lot of researchers and science students who could really use this tool for good. Tools like this can make the research process easier and help scientists push humanity forward, but you as a part of humanity also need to push yourself forward. And AI tools like ChatGPT have become the ultimate driver for that. But you need to know how to use it to really get the best possible results. And luckily, I might have something to help you get the most out of ChatGPT. We've put together a pack of prompts that you can use. This pack has tons of ready-made prompts that you can simply copy and paste. All of these prompts are not just time savers, each one is designed to maximize the effectiveness, minimize the time you spend on work, and improve earnings for your business. We believe this list will be a game changer for businesses, marketing specialists, or just anyone looking to level up their ChatGPT experience. With these prompts, 10-minute actions will take mere seconds, and your workflow will be fast and straightforward like an arrow. And now we have a huge discount, 50% the original price. So be sure to check it out, the link is in the description. Another cool AI tool is called Wolfram Alpha. Wolfram Alpha is not a new tool, but it has been refined for years. And with new AI features, it has become almost the ultimate collusion for calculations of any type. Wolfram gives the impression of an old internet of source, mainly because of its design, but underneath that outdated wrapper is a powerful AI. The website gives you a long list of things it can do in various disciplines, from math and physics to art and movies and household math. For example, Wolfram can tell you which movie has won the Oscar for the best picture in 2018. Well, that's easy, right? How about calculating the amount of calories in a 12-inch pepperoni pizza? Wolfram can do that too. Still not impressed? What about solving complex math equations? I will just copy and paste an equation and get the result with graphs and calculations. But can it tell the distance between London and Mumbai in bananas? No, sadly it can't. But frequent viewers know what can, and if you want to know too, watch our other content. Overall, I can confidently say that Wolfram Alpha is a great tool that is smarter than ChatGPT when it comes to calculations. And possibly for some people receiving information from Wolfram would be even easier than from ChatGPT, so give it a try. Here is one more interesting AI for you, Character AI. Character AI basically allows you to talk to any digital persona. For example, I can talk to Iron Man and ask the iconic question. Big man in a suit of armor, take that off and what are you? Billionaire, playboy, philanthropist, something's missing. What about genius? Seems to me that this digital Tony Stark is a bit too modest. What about Elon Musk? Right off the bat, we're wasting his time. Thanks Elon, as charming as ever. Let's ask a fun question about producing supermarket cars at Tesla. No, it won't budge. Did Elon lose his sense of humor? What about Elon's obsessive fear of AI? Okay, the digital Elon is also afraid, but less so. Maybe Elon is an alien. Okay, it thinks there are no proofs, but what about Mark Zuckerberg being a lizard? Too many proofs to ignore, but Elon once again completely ignores everything. At least we know the truth, right? No, I'm not. I am not a lizard. Anyway, if you have free time, open this AI, have some fun. It's worth checking out. I would also like to recommend two great plugins for ChatGPT. The first one being Link Reader. This plugin does exactly what you would expect. It reads the content and extracts information on any link, PDF file, PowerPoint presentation, images, Word documents, and so on. Once installed, the plugin would automatically provide you a summary of the content presented in a clear and easy to understand way. The best part about this plugin is how effortlessly it works. You just ask ChatGPT to summarize the link and boom, it's done. But Arthur, you say, why would I need this plugin if ChatGPT can summarize by default? Well, ChatGPT cannot access links, and to trick it into doing so, you need to really find the prompt combination. Link Reader just makes it super easy, basically giving ChatGPT an extended functionality, a new power it never knew it had. And the second cool plugin is Video Insights. The basic idea is almost the same. Teach ChatGPT to interact with video sharing platforms like YouTube or Dailymotion. What this means is 
notice that this plugin will watch the video for you, analyze its contents, and then answer any of your questions about the video. It's not just a video summary, it's something else. It's your personal binge watcher who will watch videos tirelessly, picking up even the smallest details and then share this knowledge with you. Do you have a 40 minute biochemistry lecture? Get ready to finish in five minutes. Or do you need some insights from a video of your favorite blogger? You will get that in a nick of time. It's really that simple and convenient. So as you see, the world of AI is big and there are always interesting tools to try. Thank you for watching guys and see you in the next one.